nice one guys so basically this morning i'm in the kitchen with another one with you guys um i'm gonna just walk you through it and show you exactly what i'm gonna be doing this morning that's so you guys can have a what's going on with chef ricotta all right this morning i want to make you some beetroot and pomegranate all right these are two red powerful ingredients right here which is also very good for you for your blood and for your heart all right yeah from week we've been doing a lot of healthy recipes and a lot of healthy juice recipes coming to me that people well a lot of people keep saying chef ricotta thank you so much and really appreciate all those healthy juice and healthy recipe what you are making so the only thing i can say that share some love all right guys 100 percent but there are quite a few people are requesting the healthy juice recipe from Chef Ricardo. All right. Yeah. And I'm trying my best to do them for the week ahead. You know what I mean? So as you can see, so far this week, we did a lot of healthy juice. All right. Whole heap of healthy juice we did this week. All right. Um, so, and this morning, I want to do you this on an amazing one. Just so simple on this one it's gonna be just um pomegranate and and beetroot this morning all right so what we're gonna do this is the beetroot which i'm gonna be using i've noticed i go and i get some fresh nice lovely organic beetroot but the thing is you have to have our gloves to remove these beetroots so i'm gonna be using roughly about one of these large one to make that beetroot juice this morning all right beautiful now as you can see, very lovely one. And I'll, I'll tell you, this beetroot is just an amazing, all right? So what I want to do, before I do anything, I'm just going to walk you through it step by step with this recipe this morning. Because, yeah, we're going to put in some pomegranate inside of the, the blender. So we're gonna get a good portion of the pomegranate. Um, so you know what happened? I, I just went to the shop this morning and I just said to myself, you know what? This is a recipe which I wanna share with you guys. You know what I mean? From the other day, I need to share this recipe with you. And I've been getting a lot of requests for the beetroot juice. All right, so a lot of people will say, Chef Ricardo, what else can I put with beetroot? So this morning, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna um, put in some pomegranate seeds into the blender like this and i'm using a portion of the pomegranate seed right here all right this is fantastic all right there are so many requests coming in for the beetroot juice so much guys it's unbelievable i didn't know that so many people like these things man you know what i mean i love my cooking but you know, when I see my audience, is saying, Chef Rekha, can I do something for me? I have to do it. All right, so this is the amount of portion of pomegranate seed what I've been using. So basically, it's just easy for you to just go to the shop and buy the one which is already ready. Unless you're going to go and get the fresh one and you're going to have to take the seed from it yourself. So I didn't want to do that one. All right. I didn't want to... Um, do that pomegranate seed one. I just want to do it so easily like this. Um, now what I'm going to do, I'm going to put some ginger in it. All right. I'm going to put some fresh organic ginger. All right. So I'm going to remove the skin from the ginger. And I'm going to... Um, cut up the ginger and put it straight inside of it. So I have some ginger. I like my ginger in my drink, you know what I mean? That makes a little bit of different. So I have a nice, lovely chunk of piece of a ginger right here, which I'm gonna put inside of it. And that's the ginger. That's lovely. Now with the pot with the with the beetroot. Alright, I'm gonna have to um Remove the skin from the beetroot. All right, guys. So yeah, the beetroot now. 
have to remove the skin from the beetroot and cut it up and wash it off and all these things. All right, so that's what I'm gonna be doing right now. But the beetroot is so powerful, guys. I will encourage you, if you do not start drink beetroot juice, you need to jump on board with Chef Ricardo. So I'm just removing the skin from the beetroot. Wow, that is lovely. The beetroot is amazing. This is color. You will see exactly what I'm talking about. Now, this is half of the beetroot, which I'm gonna put inside of the blender. All right, I'm using one large beetroot. All right, so this is the beetroot I'm using inside of it, all right? That is fantastic and amazing, guys, trust me. The beetroot, trust me. You can't go wrong with beetroot juice. Now, you, to be honest with you, you doesn't need any honey or any sweetener in it. You just wanna have it natural like this, all right? 100%. So what I'm gonna do now is just put some water in it. Just a little bit of water, not much. Yeah. I just wanna must get try and get most of the juice from the beetroot, all right? So I don't wanna be using too much liquid in it. Sometimes I will put like a one apple in it. Cause the apple, where the apple now I'm intend to do is to bring in a lovely little sweetness to it. But to be honest, with the pomegranate, we don't need to use any sweetener in our in the sugar, in the honey, or in the apple, because that alone is so sweet. Alright, but I dilute it down with a little bit of water. But that's good. Alright, and this morning, on the menu drinking this morning, if you notice every morning, I'll show you guys what now I'm gonna drink before anything in the morning. So this morning tea is, let me show you exactly. Let me show you exactly what I've been drinking this morning. So this morning tea is gonna be ginger and some cloves with lime, all right? And you can also get this one, because I was drinking this one also this morning. This one is on my website, chefrecorder.co.uk. Go over to my website right now. You can pre-order pre your, and we will ship it to you. Also, we have sour sap leaf on the website. If you're interested in sour sap leaf, we all know that sour sap leaf is so powerful. Um, it's on my website also, all right? So this is what I've been drinking this morning. And I drink this one last night before I go to my bed. Very, very good for you. It's a relaxing drink, especially for a person who work nine to five. You need to drink something like this to give you a perfect relaxing, all right? Yesterday was Friday, so we drink that. Now, right here, as I said, we got cloves ginger and the secret behind it is some key lime juice all right the lime juice makes the difference all of these now that's helped to fight against bacteria from glory growing your stomach all right a lot of people doesn't believe in those things but these things are a real thing just like your sink if you do not put drain cleaner in your sink there's bacteria gonna grow up in your sink it's just like our stomach if everything go in it is settled for a while process and then they go through the other section, all right? You know what I'm talking about. So it's the same thing. So you have to like, you know what I mean? Cleanse up your body. That's why I always say you need, it's good for you guys to cleanse your body, detox your body. But a lot of people doesn't believe in those things. But as I say, you only can bring the ass to the water, but you can't force him to drink it. But these things are real, all right? And I learned, this is what, the way I know these things are real. The other day, my sink was black. All right, and I have to get drain cleaner and I have to get plunger to plunger to drain cleaner. So the man said to me, you have to keep your sink clear at all times, not putting all sorts of rubbish down in your sink. It will block. Your body is not different. It's similar. Yeah? 
When you eat something, it goes down in your stomach and it settles for a few hours until you feel like you want to go to that place, get it out. But at the same time, you need to have something to cleanse your body in the meantime and detoxing out your body. Get rid of, filter out your body with all of those things. All right? So, I'm telling you today, I'm telling you this morning, is that guys, don't, sometimes you see I'm making a lot of drink and a lot of healthy teas. They also works. They're very good and they work. All right? It helps you to detox your body and cleanse out the bad stuff, the bad detoxing out of your body. Do not wait till when you go to your doctor, your doc your, then your doctor going to say, well, something goes wrong, you need to do this. You have to go, they have to take blood, they have to go do this, they have to go do that. Try to look after yourself and treat yourself the best right now, guys. Trust me. And you can't too old to start look after yourself. Or you can't too young. It's better for you to take action. You know what I mean? Look after yourself. Detox your body. Cleanse your body on a, on a daily basis. Cleanse your body. Very, very important for you to cleanse your body. You know, sometimes some people go to the loo and when they have, a, and they have something to hold, places simmer up because they don't have time to detox your body. They're too busy. You have to look after yourself. You know what I mean? And these are natural stuff. Natural herbs, natural thing. Even a sour sap leaf is one of the most poor. A lot of people doesn't know. <laughs> it is so powerful where it's unbelievable. You have to do your research. Do your research on all of these natural stuff, guys. You know what I mean? All of these natural juice we have been making from weeks. I've been doing this over the last two weeks now. I got a lot of faithful people who say thank you so much, Chef Ricardo, and they write it underneath my video. Really appreciate it. Or sometimes they Instagram me as a Chef Ricardo. 100% we thank you so much for this healthy juice. You don't know how much that means to us. But yeah, and that's why I keep doing it. Because a lot of people try to go healthy. And I'm here to encourage people. Healthy recipe and healthy lifestyle is the best thing in the world. And I that's why I see I switch my YouTube channel a little bit. I start to do a lot of li a healthy stuff. Because I know it works. Healthy lifestyle is the best. Yes, sometimes you can cook your chicken, your beef, your lamb, whatever. You know what I mean? But try and keep it on a healthy lifestyle, guys. It's worth it. All right? Do not too wait too long. But as I said, my, my grandmother always tell me this. And I would never forget. You only can bring a horse to the water, to the well. But you cannot force him to drink it. Trust me. And that will go down in history. 100% I should do a YouTube channel about that thing I'm only well anyway here it is we got pomegranate we got beetroot we got ginger and I'm gonna put some lime or you can put key lime in it all right guys we can't force you to make it I can't tell her what to do with your lifestyle it's up to you but thank God I'm not smoking I'm not drinking I'm not partying I try to live a nice clean life by the group by the grace of God, all right? Now, let's blend this, guys. And let's long talk in Chef Ricardo. But I have to give you guys a few tips, all right? Let's blend up this. All right? So we're gonna strain this now. All right, I'm gonna run it through my strainer. Anyway, I brought a new one to see how this one work. But this is not the one where I wanna buy. You know what I mean? I just get this one because, um, oh, you see, I like my other strainer. You know what I mean? I don't. I only just brought this one because I say, all right, you see how this one work. Some of the I like my little strainer, you know. So basically what I did want, I want a little bit of the fiber to come out of this into the juice.
all right nice one so you can see all ticket is guys that looking really good 100% trust me the thickness of it is amazing one so as i can see not too bad to be honest with you i'm gonna pour the rest inside of it and that looking good yeah so guys, when you drink um, like a beetroot like this, the beetroot juice, it's very good for the blood, very good for the heart, and then, you know what I mean? So I, that's why I was trying to, to fill in a few, because not only that, I got a lot of requests for beetroot juice. So many requests, so many people saying, Chef Ricardo, what else can you do with beetroot? And I try my best to show them a lot of ideas, what you can do with beetroot. You know what I mean? Beetroot can mix with a lot of stuff. And me personally, I love beetroot juice because when you drink beetroot juice, you get the result from it and you can see what's going on in your body when you drink beetroot juice, especially if you drink it for a week. Trust me, you know what I mean? You free up your bowel, make you know what I mean? When you go to the toilet, you can't feel no pain. Everything is just like perfect. You understand? So that's why I like to drink the beetroot juice. All right. Um... Sorry, yeah, girl. Good morning. I just saw you. Nicole, good morning. I didn't even see that, Nicole. That Nicole was online. Big up yourself, Nicole. So this morning, we do the beetroot and pomegranate. Two red combination together with some ginger and lemon. And not only that, the ginger is amazing. Lovely. Morning, Nicole. Good morning. Good morning. All right. Now, as I can see, all right, that the only thing with beetroot, you know, is red, man. Anytime you're using it, every way it starts to get red. But I love it. And when you use beetroot, when you drink beetroot juice for at least three to four days, you see some powerful result from it. All right. Now we're gonna get a lemon, or you can get a lime. So I'm going to be using a lime. All right. So we get a lime and we squeeze it in like this. And that is lovely. All right. Yeah. Nice. And that is amazing all right so you see there's a little bit of the fiber come out from it that's why i do want it all right and that is lovely look at that guys beautiful drink for you guys to drink at home all right so that's pomegranate seed and beetroot 100 effective for your body very good and you guys will love it trust me you guys will love this one so let's pour this into our glass and that's what chef ricardo normally do every morning and this is just such a lovely drink all right look at that that is uh, amazing anyway i'm not gonna be keeping the show too long this morning because you know i mean a lot of people say chef ricardo your show is too long it's getting bored but here it is, another one from Chef Ricardo this morning. And as I can see, look at that. That is just amazing. Pomegranate seed and beetroot with ginger and lemon. Give that a try at home. If you notice every morning, I try to give you something new and something different, but it's the same ingredients. Just like chicken or beef or lamb, whatever, you can cook it a million times different. It's the same thing with all of these natural juice. You can mix it with anything different, all right? So this morning, I give you pomegranate seed and beetroot, all right? So if I check my inbox again and see what someone else want me to make, then I will make it for them, all right? I think I give you 
beetroot and orange before which is a wicked combination so there's a lot of stuff you can do with the same ingredients but it's the same fruits same thing but you can mix it with different stuff at home all right you can mix it with cucumber you can mix it with orange you can mix it with apple you can mix it with this you can mix it with that here's this thing big up yourself mr president obama big up yourself you know what i mean um you know here's this thing. i was watching um Soulflow TV and the man was saying, what kind of name is that the man? He doesn't know that you're one of the biggest supporters upon YouTube. Probably he didn't know that. You cannot say that. Here's his him. Nah, man, you can't say that, man. You have to big up this man, man. This man is the biggest support. Anyway, we love your name. We love it. And we respect you every time because you always support us. You know what I mean? No matter when someone comes on your YouTube channel, you big them up. All right? So respect, my brother, and keep supporting us. All right? Now, as you can see, this is it right here. This is was amazing. Fantastic, lovely, and just a delicious, delicious drink this morning for you guys. All right? So, yeah. Another one from Chef Ricardo. And this one, he said, as I say, is pomegranate seed and beetroot. Mix them together. And it's just an amazing recipe. All right? And as I say, this is what I did. This is the pomegranate. I just get the one them in the already prep and ready. Yeah. This one is already prep, all right? So, this is just like one of those kind of, it's more easier for me, you know what I mean? And that's the reason why I don't, when I go to the supermarket and I'm gonna look for this one. You can get this the, the, the one and just prep it yourself, but sometimes it's a little bit annoying, you know what I mean? And every way it's just that messed up. Uh, yeah. Yeah, man, all is a support, man. Big up yourself, my brother. All of us support from you. Thank you so much for the support. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for your love this morning and for, you know what I mean, have a lovely weekend. Today is Saturday. You guys, just look after yourself. Be strong and be blessed. And, you know what I mean, I will see you guys during the day with another one. All right? Yeah. So, I will see you. Um, My Facebook audience, big up on yourself. Wally Pan Love and respect. Don't think I forgot you guys, but, yeah, there's a lot of love over you for you. All right? So, thank you for watching and stay tuned in with Chef Ricardo this morning. All right, yeah, Wally Pan Love and respect from Chef Ricardo. All right, all right, um, yeah, see you later on, Nicole and Yagra. Yeah, Thank you so much, and I will see you guys in a bit. Bye bye.